Well, I spent a lot of time working on this. Well, in terms of figuring out exactly what I need it to be, and there is a number of wrongs in this thing. Um, the first wrong is up here with all of this. Uh, the stairwell needs to be three wide, absolutely, without any question of a hope of a thought of a doubt. And the starting top stair needs to go that way a block. So that there is actually a reasonable space here going into it. And this here, well... Basically, start by taking this stuff down. Not quite that way. All right. Something like that. Yeah. And I'll need some more cobble stairs. And, of course, I'll have to dig all of this out. And not a problem, really. Not a big issue at all. Here's another wrong. That can't be there. All right, let me throw this in here. Get myself a little bit of room to work here. Yeah. See, that part is no good. The stair needs to start there. And so, get some dirt down here. Uh, yeah, I already had it. Yeah. Okay, yeah, you get a few more, oh, for crying out loud, you're telling me the only one of these is right over here. No, that's not going to do. some of those going on. Hmm. Now here's an idea. Just to kind of change it off a little bit. Let's get some of the stone brick.
try this on for size. Better. Of course, now I've got a bang your head thing going on in this thing. I'm going to have to move this back a little bit. All right. Not a problem. Move that whole wall section back. And we'll just... Hmm. Do I have any more of this birch over here? Uh, it must all be outside. People, go away. I'm busy trying to do things and be all creative and such, you know? You take your, oh, I'm going to eat your brains crap and go peddle it next door. Oy, oy, oy. Um, that wall, well, it can't move too far because there's that door, and that door is not moving. Move this part of it. All right. Something like that. I'm short a bit, but all right. Now, the use that I had in mind for the mossy originally, right up here around the edge, it makes sense. And by the way, this whole entire wall, that whole entire wall is wrong. And I can even see continuing the mossy like that diagonally down. And even here. But this here. That's got to go. And as a matter of fact, where it's got to go, is a way. It needs to be filled in because this here's the outside wall. That there is the outside wall. That's the foundation, which is the top of the outside wall underground portion. So, this whole thing needs filled in. Yeah, it absolutely has to be. Now, I was thinking maybe that the stone brick would be good for walls. That could work. And the ceiling in here. I am thinking to go with plain, flat, featureless, smooth stone. With a touch here and there of something else. Uh, 
All right, now up here. one line of the mossy cobble and then after that that is where we fill in with the stone brick And where it's going to connect with the ceiling. Now, let's see. Yeah, there's an idea. Uh, yeah. I think maybe we might have something here. Okay. I can't go along with that. That I can go along with. All right, now, as you can see here, stone brick comes along the ceiling, and then That's where we have this, and we have the stone, and the stone will come out, uh, well, let's start over here. Let's see, that's one, two, three, ugh. Goof in my part. All right. No. Um, mossy on that block and down here. Up here, just dirt because it's not going to be seen. And there's where the mossy top end of it goes. Yeah, something like that. All right, now one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten at least. All right, so it comes out like that. And let's see one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And so here all right, right out here is where it changed us up a little bit. You got ten rows both ways. Of smooth stone all 
And that's where stone brick comes back in. Hmm. Let's see. What if I did that? No, 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 no. No, not like that. Like that. That way it doesn't cover up the mossy stone. And we've got the stone brick coming out like this. And of course it continues like that. And it also continues like that. And then every place where they meet like this, this is where we fashion out some kind of support pillar of something and it's entirely possible the floor may have to go down a block but let's see what can we do here Hmm. Now there's a thought. Okay. We've got stone brick and we got stone brick stairs. So we have in the middle the stone brick pillar comes down. And the stairs going like this. that and then around on the bottom uh, that can stay like that might possibly just about think of having something of a plan here. The bulk of the ceiling is in the smooth stone with these stone brick ribs coming out here like that. And then where they join up, you have a pillar like this. And that might be a thing. There's other possibilities, but that's at least something to think about. Now, these pillars would be 10 blocks apart. And that allows for a good sized basement. The pillars. I think it looks interesting and it provides the appearance of physical strength and support and I'm still thinking maybe the floor needs to go down one more block so this whole arrangement would go down as well. Yeah, that I think might just be a thing. I have terrible aim today, but yeah, and this bit right there, I like that as well. Mm 
And if I did it like this, that could be cool too. Okay, so and this isn't necessarily where the thing's going to end at because I don't know, honestly. But that's just the idea, that wherever it meets the wall, we have this arrangement here. And at the top, behind, we've got the mossy stone. So, we'll throw that in here. me yeah I'm kind of liking the look of that and I definitely like the pillars like that And the smooth stone and stone brick have just enough similarity and just enough difference to make it work. Yeah. I think this is very likely something of a thing. It's going to involve a whole lot of, uh, oh, hey, yeah. If I leave this like that, I don't have to bring this down. I can just, bring this along like so. Put those back up there. Give that the stone brick thing. And then make with the stone brick stairs along this way. And what happened up here? Oh, of course it cornered the way they always do. Yeah, I, th I think I'm liking that. It's simple. It's not overly complicated, complex, or involved. And it's taking basic, it's just like three variations on the, the, the same basic texture. You've got your basic stone, stone brick, and its distant cousin, the uh, mossy stone. And it's up around the top of the basement wall here. Because as somebody pointed out, mossy stone, as in stone that is covered with moss, which would be a moisture-related thing. That does make sense. All right, let me get some more of these stairs. All right. Wonder what happened to those two pieces that didn't pop back out. <laughs> okay. Well, 
yeah, I, I think this is going to work. All right, how far are we going here? All right, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then here. Just to mark where the next set of uh, stone brick ribs are on the ceiling as it continues to move that way and it would keep going that way as well for a reasonable space it doesn't have to be like an entire freaking parking garage and in the stone segment up here I guess some more stone, don't I? I think the uh, the stone is going to need to be broke up a little bit with some lighting. And that might end up being, will probably end up being glowstone. Just simply because it's going to be the easiest thing to deal with. Yeah. I think we've got something here. And uh, it's just taking a few simple elements and working with them. What are you doing like that? Yeah, a few simple elements and uh, pulling some kind of a shape out of them. And I, I think this pillar design is going to work. Not 100% sure about the torches on it, but it is kind of a natural. And I'm hoping to come up with some kind of lighting that doesn't actually have a torch every two blocks on the wall because that would not be great. And I don't really want the... Uh, oh. <coughs> oh. I don't really want them on the floor like this either, but for now they need to be there because I don't want to get blown up either. Yeah. But uh, I think this here is the beginning of something that might just start to look like a plan. And you know, I really wish the mossy variety of both cobblestone and stone brick could actually be made into stairs. Mossy stone brick stairs and mossy cobblestone stairs could be very cool. But of course, we're not allowed to do that. Because reasons and all sorts of other hairy nonsense. But anyway, it's a good start. And maybe it's taken me a heck of a long, lot longer to come up with this. I mean, I know uh, there are, you know, somebody like Wells Knight could have slapped this together in two minutes. <laughs> I know he could have. I've seen him do stuff like this. Uh, you know, it just comes out and it's like, oh, well, let's just do that. Bang, it's done. Uh, it's taken me a lot longer to come up with it, but... I'm not worried about that because this works. I like the pillar. Really. This pillar works. So if we just do that, that's where the next one would be. And dig that up. Stare it up. If I can put them down correctly. Yep. 
Yeah. And then we just do that. Yeah. That's going to work. That is so totally going to work. Oh, come on, you. Yeah, that is going to work. I like that. It looks good. It's simple and easy to do and it's not overstated i mean the support pillars in a basement or underground area they're not supposed to be the central focus of the place they're just kind of a thing in the background that helps hold the building up you know but uh yeah i'm liking this i like where this is going i'm going to work on this some more uh, between this episode and the next one and see if I can't get this thing fleshed out a little bit more. And, uh, yeah, and I think I am going to take the floor down at least one more block. And uh, we'll see how things look. And I'm not sure whether I want the stairway here to have the, the stone brick in the middle like that or put cobblestone in the middle and stone brick on the sides. And, of course, this wall here will be made up to match this one, with one exception. This is an inside wall, and it is not exposed or out there where the moisture is or for exposure to the outside or whatever it is that causes the stone to become all mossy like that. So, no, there will not be mossy stone on this side. But, yeah. There, there's some stuff happening here, and I like the way it's looking. And I think this is going to work very nicely. Uh, we'll see where we can take this uh, next time. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. I am out of here.